Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to prepare chicken palau. I am going to add potatoes to my chicken palau. If you don't want, you can just remove the potatoes. So the ingredients that I require to prepare this recipe are here I have taken half kilo of basmati rice and I have soaked it for near about 2 hours. See, it breaks like this. So soaked, washed and soaked for 2 hours. Here I have taken near about half a kilo of potatoes. These are small potatoes and I have also slitted them also as you can see. So that the spices goes in it. So potatoes are optional. Since we like potatoes so I am adding potatoes in this pulao. You don't like potatoes you can just remove this. Here I have taken half kilo of chicken, salt as per our taste, oil for cooking. Here I have taken one inch cinnamon stick. You can see near about two star anise, small ones, two bay leaves, two medium sized onions sliced. This is two medium sized tomatoes roughly chopped. Here it, I have taken 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste, half a teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder, half a teaspoon of coriander powder, half a teaspoon of cumin powder, 1 fourth teaspoon of black pepper powder. Then I have taken little bit of freshly chopped coriander leaves, 1 lemon and three green chilies. Apart from these friends, I am going to prepare this pulao. So I will be using lukewarm water. So now let's get started. So the first step friends, I have heated near about four tablespoon of oil and I am going to first reduce the flame then add the spices, bay leaves. cinnamon stick, star anise and then I am going to add the onions. I sauté the onions till it gets slightly cooked. So friends, now as you can see, the onions are slightly cooked. So I am going to add the ginger and garlic paste. And now, sorted this along with the onions so that the raw smell of this ginger and garlic disappears. Now friends, once the raw smell of the ginger and garlic disappears, we will add the chicken pieces. And now we will saute this. And cook till the chicken changes its color and becomes slightly fried type. Now friends, as you can see, our chicken is slightly fried also and the texture is lovely. Right now I am going to add the potatoes. I am using the small small potatoes. If you are using the big potatoes, just cut them into four pieces and if you are using the medium size, cut them into half. And now I will fry this the potatoes and the chicken together. I'll add the tomatoes also. Just 
just let it get slightly fried so now friends as you can see it's nicely fried the potatoes also having a lovely texture I'm going to add the dry spices that is the coriander powder cumin powder red chili powder and the black pepper powder we'll mix it now friends for the spices to get cooked properly i'm just going to add a little bit of lukewarm water maybe a quarter cup of lukewarm water and then i will saute this i will add salt as per our taste I will saute this for 2 minutes. Now friends, as you can see, spices are nicely coated with the potatoes and the chicken. Here I will add 2 cups of water. I am adding lukewarm water friends. And now mix it. it up nicely add a little bit of coriander leaves now we will cover this and let the potatoes get cooked prop not uh, full hundred percent at least eighty percent the potatoes should get cooked now friends we'll open the lid you can see the water is dried up and our potatoes are also almost done. Yes, potatoes are also done. So now friends, it's time to cook the rice. So what are we going to do is we will first add for uh, near about half kilo of rice, we will add one liter of water. If you are adding 2 cups of rice, you will add 4 cups of water. So I have warmed 1 liter of water. I will add the lemon juice. Add the green chilies. Add little bit coriander leaves. If required, add little salt. I have tasted the salt, so I felt it's little less. So I will add little bit more salt. And now I will cover this and bring it to boil. So now, friends, when we remove the lid, as you can see, the water is boiling. Now once the water boils, we are going to add the rice. So add the rice slowly. And now mix it.
mix it up gently now friends we will cook this rice till the water gets dried up it will take hardly 7 to 8 minutes now friends after near about 7 minutes i'll remove the lid wow as you can see the water is almost dried up now this is the time friends when we will give dum to this recipe so to give dum i'm going to heat a tawa first so friends here i have placed one tawa and then i have placed the dechi on top of it and then i am going to add the remaining coriander leaves spread the rice nicely then friends you have to take a clean cloth clean cotton cloth place it over it and then cover it with the lid so for 5 minutes i'll put it on high flame and then for 10 minutes i'll put the gas into sim and then i'll leave it like that so after 15 minutes friends i am going to remove the lid here the pulao is ready it's perfectly done so now it's ready to serve so friends here is our yummy chicken pulao ready serve it hot with salad or raita It's a very quick and easy recipe friends. I often prepare this during the weekends. I hope you liked my recipe friends. Please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to stay updated with my latest recipe videos. See you soon friends. Bye.